The following feature is rated SM for spiritual maturity and is not intended for the immature who wishes to remain as such. The views expressed are not necessarily those of our sponsors as they sometimes could care less about what the host is saying but is more concerned about having their product on a popular show. Warning, small minds, listen at your own risk as this content is extremely overwhelming and may do further damage to those minds closed off to objective reality. Approach with an open mind as the heavy nature of the content will lick your chip. Your chip. Your chip. In the meantime, 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 in between time, time in the meantime, in the meantime, in between time, time. Yes, Purple Nation, yes, Rasta, Curly Locks, the Vice, Box, a check in, yes, for one more episode of In the Meantime, yes, episode 43, entitled, Shot in the Foot, <laughs> I tell you right now, Rasta, yeah, man, this is we are going to talk about a culture of self-sabotage, yeah, man, Rasta, right now, yeah, man, which is still very much connected and related to the last topic we're going to talk about, yes, the wall of shame, yeah, man, because we're now, we have a serious wall in front of spiritual success. In any kind of relationship, by any level, I tell you that, Rasta, yes, man, shame is a serious wall to progress in, a, in a any level of relationship, yeah, man. Anyway, I'm going to get deeper into these issues, yeah, man, in the second half of the program. But watch out now. Before we get in it, yeah, man, remember to like, share, and subscribe. Big up each and every purple soldier who hold it with me and Zion. Through the many setbacks, yeah, man, we have to threaten to stop the show. I'm going to go into some things tonight, but watch out now. As usual, this section of the program is brought to you by Vicebox Studios, the vice of a nation. Yes, Rasta, me I tell you. And Rebel 13 Collections, it's at Rebel 13 Collections for the finest in custom design clothing. And every pink printing, except fingerprinting, Rasta, me I tell you that. Yes, so watch out now again. In the meantime, it's also brought to you by Bunks About Kids Party Rentals, it's at Bunks about for the finest in all things related to kids' parties, fun days, and other events. Yeah, man. So don't just bunks go all about when you all look. Yeah, man. For the right people, them. Yeah, man. For customize and experience for your child or just regular patrons in general that they will never forget. Yeah, man. Don't bunks go all about. Bunks about. Yes, Rasta. Call them now. 876 404 1714. Yes, Rasta. And this section is also brought to you by Renaissance Immigration Services. Yeah, man, them deal with all things immigration in a Canada. Just call Renaissance now at 437-703-1147 to eat. Means say, 1147 or 1148. The consultation is absolutely free. And as usual, if you're in America and hear about Renaissance Immigration, you would have, yeah, you would have want a service similar to this one, yeah, man. Don't panic. Yes, there is Louis Law. Professional association, yeah man. Yeah man, like me always say, all when the whole graveyard the immigration cross is a running down in America somewhere, them yeah, tell you Rasta. Them can put a stop to it, yeah man. Them deal with all things, yeah man, like visa, citizenship, removal of conditions, and the response with shampoo, yeah man, yeah man. Waivers and all matters related to immigration in America. Call now, 954-530-1717 for access immigration. Heaven, 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 heaven. In the meantime. All right, yes, yes. The comment of the day is coming from Karen Ellis, number one. Yes. Karen, I say, bless up Vice Box. Yes. I don't remember if I read it in your book. I heard it, and in the meantime, you be bored. But I once heard you say that all things have use and serve a vital purpose. But I was listening to the last episode of In the Meantime, The Wall of Shame. And it hit me. I don't see what positive purpose shame could have. Also, I always hear you say that we are, we, are, we are connected to one grid of universal consciousness. And therefore, everything that is in other people's consciousness is in ours. And make us capable of the same thing. Yeah, so, my question is, yeah, yeah, say, my question is, if your theory is right, and we are all connected to this one mind, then wouldn't that mean we shouldn't credit people for the things they think, do, or speak? 
if it is that we are not unique. Yeah, yeah. Wouldn't this make you wrong about the, the importance of going to others, like you said on the last program? Because this connection would mean we truly don't need others or need to go to them for anything if we ourselves are capable of the same things they are capable of. All right, Kiran, I'm going to answer you upon the, upon the question of shame first, and then I'm moving to the question of, of the one with of consciousness where require, we require might require a more extensive or longer answer. So, so the shame, you know, all right. Remember now, you know, I believe so, all things have use, including, including shame, yes. And that, it, it is just a matter of, of balance, you understand, when yeah, we're, we're determined then, yeah. How, how, how these things turn out. You mean you assess a situation and um, determine um, how, how, how you should handle it, you're saying? Yeah, man, shame is both a barrier and a bridge to success in anything. That's and absolutely wait, wait, rubbish. Wait, that, wait. Hold on, my brother. Hold, hold on, hold on. That makes no sense. It's a ridiculous Oh, you mean that don't make no sense, Bridgine? Watch her, man. Hey, watch her. As much as the fear of shame, Make a man do and uh, run the risk of doing the right thing then. Yeah, man, I uh, end up embarrassed. And the same fear of shame. Make them do the right thing in order to avoid the embarrassment. We are going to come if they, if they not do it. I tell you, no part of the consciousness and no accident. The whole of them, everything when our consciousness, serve, serve a vital purpose. And they for a reason. You can't find no part of the consciousness when we, we not have no use. Because for about the million time you know, me I go tell you now, our one-dimensional belief system fuck up everything and make them malfunction. And here comes twin reality again because what? It's not that shame itself. It's just one fuck up thing where, where you forget rid of all to complete. It's just that both versions of shame suffer for the reputation of the most popular version of it, which is the judgment and condemnation version. So people don't see the positive use of it. Which is the one who motivates you for act right. Alright now, Kiran, as to as it relates to your question of one grid of consciousness and, and going to others and them things. Alright, let me tell you something. Alright. You see, because we live in our system, we give you an exaggerated sense of self-worth or importance. And cut we are from, 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 the, from understanding the importance then, yes, of going to others. It makes we see others completely different from ourselves and give you the foolish notion. So we don't need no one but ourselves. But nothing could have further from the truth, Rasta. Really? Yeah, man, that they far from truth. You have to take three planes, four bus, and 24 taxi. And we see this kind of belief, you know, and lead to more and more. Yeah, man, I lead more and more to a kind of spiritual, solitary confinement in a today society. Yes, man, more than ever. Yeah, you, you, man, it's even worse now. You may tell you that. Where everyone is now half, yeah, in a them own little world, I try to be individual in the wrong definition or meaning of the word. I believe so because we universally connect to this one grid of consciousness or this one mind then, yeah. It makes me believe, say, other people, yes, others, are just a different manifestation of self, yeah, man. So going to other people with any kind of problem is actually going to self. Could you start having a spooky language alert so you can adequately prepare me? For the sudden and vicious assaults of lunacy and madness that you often display. I would so love that, my brother. Where I say, where, 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 madness, what? Where I say, what hard in that for understand? I just don't see how going to others is going to ourselves, my brother. That's rubbish. All right. All right. Watch out now. Let me talk slow for you. All right. I believe we all connected to one grid of universal consciousness. You understand? Meaning to have one mind, every human, connect to the same mind. It's only true. Each of we get to make different choice from the same mind. And experience different outcomes. Make we individually think, say, at different minds all that we have. And this approach to consciousness is not my theory. You know, Karen. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, tell me I clear that up. It's not my theory. This is actually a spiritual, objective fact. Yeah, man. It's a fact, brethren. I tell you that. Even Buddhism then have its foundation in, in a, this, this thing I call theory. But, my brother, that doesn't answer the question. Wait, 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 what wait, do what, you mean? What? Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. What do you mean by going to others is, is, is actually going to yourself? Could you please explain that to a stressed out pastor? That has less than three brain cells left after trying to 
cope with you and your nonsense. And on this show, since the first episode was created in December 2019 and released in January All right, 2020. All right. All right, Kiran, watch out now. Even though we connect to the same grid of consciousness, one mind and capable of the same things, one person cannot experience life by themselves. The amount of things where they would have a knowledge of love in order to survive it. It is why different people get different inspirations in a different direction. Because one person cannot be everything where, where, where it's possible for them to be at one. So I even though the musician then, for example, quite capable of becoming a doctor or a lawyer, he cannot become all three of them and be effective at any one of them at once. So every other person or different version of ourself then get different inspirations towards other areas. So we can we can we can help one another for survive life because helping somebody else is helping myself. So yes, Kiran, we are all capable of the same things, Bridget. But can be all of what we capable of or be all those versions of ourselves at once. So everyone who play them part and focus in a particular direction on something. Where you might not have otherwise ever think about from your barn till you're dead. Should be credited. Because that no must cross your mind forever. Even do it in your consciousness. That is why a man can hear a song or read a philosophy or a book. And it resonates with them. Because yes, the information is, is, is a part of them consciousness. And that's why you see it as common sense. But who make you realize that? That's so true. That's, that, that makes sense. So yeah man, there is different parts of, of nature or life. That is needed in order to survive it. But none of we. Yeah man, we can't be them. We can't be all of them at once, Rasta. So what? The brain surgeon are gonna need the tailor. You know, the same way. The criminal are gonna need a liar. And a man are gonna need a woman and vice versa. Because again, we can't be all things and the things that we can be. We can't be at one. Why are so many people misled on, 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 on these things? Why do they not see the truth? That often is staring them in the face. That is just right there, my brother. I myself is, is very guilty of that. Uh, what do you think that is, my brother? Because again, the thing is, we live in a system where we are addicted to everything. We, we, we are depressed, we are stressed, we are out. Because everything where we believe in, uh, yeah, man, lead right to depression. No matter how your common sense a shot, your social instincts will make out of your beliefs. Contradict it and keep you going right back to everything we are depressed you. We all connected, Virgin, me I tell you. That's why you can't have the worst prison in the world, Rasta. And around the worst set of criminals and you're good. Yeah, man, you just try to avoid them. You just try to protect life and body. But once you drop in a solitary confinement where you're there by yourself too long, you're done. That's so true. Yeah, man. You come out of that Ras and you shit and attack back way like Papa San in a 93. Humans, because of the original design of an innate our inborn connection with each other. But are the lie where the system built on top of the original programming. Because the whole of the problem bridging. Because you know, if a man did not have original state of mind like it was before the fall from grace, we would need the social laws where it takes to control human behavior. In a this hellier name earth. You believe that? Yeah man, me totally believe so at some point humans, yeah man, did have a divine intelligence where create a social structure where, where, where it's based on cooperation and not the excess competition like the one where we're trapping her right now. And we did, at, at some point, we did understand, say, a one mind we did have. And that other people was just different version of we, who inspired in a different, in a different directions for the purpose of helping one another with the things where we can be at the same time. And yes, brethren, we would need la. Just like with Bob Marley say. Bob Marley said that, my brother? Yeah, man. You remember when, when in the interview with Bob Marley say every law is illegal. And no way no truly need law and all government are fuckery. But why would, he, why would he say that, though? Because just like me, I believe, say, him did believe. Say, humans in a them true spiritual farm wouldn't need government or governing. Because what? We would have follow with internal objective, divine, moral laws were built in. And we wouldn't need no one for determine right from wrong to we. Because what? We would have fully telepathic. And the word of the day, yes, is telepathic. Yeah man, it means capable of transmitting thoughts to other people and of knowing their thoughts. Yeah man, psychic. Yeah man, why you think it is make no person on earth cannot morally escape the concept of right and wrong? No one cannot escape that. No matter where we, we, we lower state of self, I try to tell you, say, and I try to override these objective truths in, in our consciousness. We can't escape that. So, uh, my brother. Yeah. Where has our ability 
to, to be telepathic gone since um, you claim that our ability to instinctively know right from wrong is still intact, my brother. You know, God, no way, Bridget. It is just mostly diamond that are asleep then, if you want to know what diamond means, yes. Yeah, man, are true. We, are, it, 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 we live in a state a consciousness. We program against with natural impulses. And abilities, Bridget, I can't say that enough. Everything we believe cause we to misunderstand. And avoid these parts of our nature. This telepathic capability is evident. When, when, when something happens, and, and you know, everybody I think, and now, nah, and now nah, say, at this, them call the elephant in the room. All humans have a telepathic connection with each other. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. They have a connection to each other. And we believe system cars we for acting ways we constantly. Cars we try to override or sideline this connection. But all are we connected, Virgin. Yeah, man. We connected to one mind functioning. Are expressing itself as many, and we think of all heap of minds. So we see different bodies with different colors, size, and shapes, and different label, 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 label. In the meantime, truth and reality and a dream time. Curly locks. In the meantime, listen to theme time. Six the king has a purple near your shirt. When we say purple, we mean that. All right, yes, purple people, watch I know. All right. Cat Williams did say them brainwash with if you believe said there is 24 hours in a day, man. Yeah, man. So you will agree if you give up 8 hours of your day. Yeah, man, at the job. That's so true. Yeah, man, because when you check it out, you know, you know. If at 24 hours in a one day and you sleep out the night for over 8 hours and get ready for work, <laughs> yeah, man, with at, with at least 3 or 12 productive hours left. And them don't tell you that. And you don't realize that for yourself. And the reason why them don't tell you say only 12 is because why? If you know that, you wouldn't give them 8. The whole of 8 hours out of that 12 hours. Many people want a lot of things and just want them easy. But me, I will tell you again, is the concept of easy will really make life so hard. The idea of make a serious plan and focus on it and stick to it. Because we have less time than we think, Rasta. Because if the average person, Rasta, night sleep. Is eight hours. Watch out now when every problem is a much problem. Yeah, but if the average person is, 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 is night sleep at eight hours, it is a third of a day. Yeah, man, which is a third of a day. That means the average person sleep for a third of them life. And this is not my argument. It's a science in a rasta. If you live for seven, 75 year old, that are 25 years of, of, of you're you sleeping, you know, rasta, out of your whole entire 75, you know. Or if you know one year, it's so it is 9,125 days. Now imagine. Say, put on top of that, the average person a sleep walk through them life. Meaning, say, all when them, when them up, them still asleep. Brain dead. It rough. No time for idle, brethren. This song, you know, is not a new song. Yeah, man. And it's not an it's artist. It's not an artist when new to in the meantime. Yeah, man. Because in the meantime, I one of the program them. We help send the artist your road. Yeah, so. Diani, show them how you do it. When life too short for argue with people or have them up over whose fault it is. It's me again, it's me again, uh, uh, uh. day by day, we still are hunted day by day, we are confronted day by day, uh, never get a holiday, if day for we lay by day, we still are hunted day by day, we are confronted day by day, uh, Never get a holiday, every day for me, I live by day. Hey, hey, oh, one looking now. Can't spend my life, just put you up. Prioritize, give me all I do it out. Under the sun, the end, we still have people from my mouth. And every day we face like pressure. Never will last, but we still have to get up. All we know, man, hungry and fed up. Still, I keep we head up. Never giving up. Hey, hey, hey. It's me again. It's me again. Day by day, we still are hunted day by day. We are confronted day by day. Never get a holiday, if day for we lay by day 
We still not want it day by day We can't front it day by day Oh, never get a holiday Every day for me a day by day Hey, hey, oh, I'm looking out Just spend my life, just put you out Prioritize, give me all I do it out Under the sun, yeah, and we still have it from my mouth no. And every day we face like pressure The power last, but we still have to get out All when my man hungry and fed up Still I keep we head up Never giving up day by day. day We still are on this day by day They are confronted day by day oh, Never get a holiday Every day we are never day We still are on this day by day We are confronted day by day Get out of the day, but that's for me and everybody Working so much for a little But then they say every when life starts to lick ya yeah. 40 hours of the week, 40 years of your life 40% to get back when you see the bigger picture yeah, wow. Big body bands, big land and big house Money in a pocket get a youth at that boat Dead and live from hand to mouth Work too hard for you live like church crowds Day by day, we still are on it day by day But I can't front it day Never get a holiday, but never for me a labor day Man still a front it day by day Man a confront it day by day Never get a holiday, yo Day, yo Me say day, 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 yo Me night come on me walk Man still a front it day by day I got fun today, by day Never get to let it every day for me and never day One thing I got to say by day But I got fun today, by day Never get to let it every day Miss it, 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 Straight work, bring it in, yeah man. No, no only for chatting, brethren. No only for wishing. Pan a star for be a star. So this one available as usual, yeah man. Pan all reputable online platforms, yeah man. Support good music, yeah man. I stop asking for them there because you know, you understand. Be the solution and not the problem. Yeah man, get my book, Planet Earth, yes. Available on Amazon.com, yes. Planet Earth, book.com also, yeah. And them coming all farm, so you know, so you can get the audio book for audible and iTunes and just about anyway. Audio book sell, Rasta, yeah. So it's available locally, yes, at JA Deals, Canton Spring Road, located right across from the transport center, Rasta. And you don't know. Check out them website at yeah, JADeals.com for them for them other locations with them have it. So JA Deals also ship internationally to the Caribbean. Yeah man, and I want to big up to at Black Knight 123, yeah man, whose business pages. At Capo Beauty Supplies, yeah man, big up the eye self, man, respect. I hear so the eye, yeah man, support the book and I spread it in every way the eye can, man. I hear so you pass through JA deals and holy for thing go on. Alright, big up yourself. Don't forget to tell them that it's also located down in selected locations of Kingston Bookshop. <laughs> you see that ideal if you got that in the roster. You so life inspire you remember that when me forget. Yes, we do that's so we work together, yeah. Yeah, man. Yes, I remember the re-release of the Road to Zion. Yes, the revised version on January 12th. Yes, look out for that. This next section of In the Meantime is brought to you by Renaissance Immigration. Yeah, man, them deal with all things immigration in Canada. Yes, them can fix the visa where you overstay because you're frightened and run off and now people are take advantage of the item in every way. Shape and farm, yeah, man, and the item of your work for less than where them work. Yeah, man, them days they done. Just link Renaissance Rasta at 437-703-1147 to 8. And again, the consultation is absolutely free, brethren, remember. No matter where we are going to Rasta. Renaissance believes as long as there was a way into your immigration problem, there is always a way out. Way out, way out, way out. In the meantime. Yeah, man, the advice of the after the bushland. Send the girl advice back in the meantime. In the meantime. In the meantime. Why do I get the feeling that I don't have to ask what's in the news? So for those who don't know, recently, up and coming artist, Joshi, do an interview, yeah man, for a local Jamaican television program named The Entertainment Report, you understand? So, him see a lot of things in this interview, you know, gain him national attention, yeah man, go viral. 
him speak a lot of uncomfortable truth in that interview. We resonate with many people, yeah, man. Some people are wonder if I if have bravery and some people are wonder if the liquor, including Anthony Miller, the interviewer. Well, them say Tom junk, but Tom no fool. But I believe if Tom never fool, he wouldn't junk. Because the proverb say, wine is a maca and strong drink is raging. And whosoever is deceived thereby is not wise. But they also say, uh, drunk heart speak a sober mind. Remember that? That is true. Because if you say nothing, when you not hear people say in the ghetto every day, even when they're fully sober. How much time you got to tell you, no, say, the ghetto is a slave plantation where them program we against ourselves through our beliefs. We make we overly emotional and put feelings before everything and carry around baggage where we refuse to put on. And don't know, say, a pure illusion make everything we're in this baggage. Yeah. I have seen the kind of unnecessary pain and anger in my surroundings growing up with family and friends. Even my brother, where you see there, I did have to turn up trunk to keep him out of prison because of this programming against my own upliftment. So, my brother, what do you, what do you think um, helps with the, the continuous cycle of this ghetto slavery as you often describe it? What makes it continue? Because when people are exposed to a different perspective than the one where them know, is that one perspective or view upon reality they are going to use and measure everything. And that I go always a carry them back same place in the pain because in reality they never left. And this is not just a ghetto thing in a Rasta. This is what make every kind of conflict you can think about. So terrible because what? Everyone just a guess and assume about the next perspective. Where them don't know so them cannot truly know unless them experience it. That's why I always wish uptown and downtown could have trade place for a week. Like what Busy Signal is saying I'm saying. That's so true. Yeah, man, I, I, I wish every youth, every ghetto youth could have fly out at least once, go somewhere in our world. So they don't get to realize that the world bigger than all the pain and frustration force them to see. What you see in this interview yeah, is rightfully an angry youth, a play theme part in a script written by a system where you use this script, design a mindset where he inherit from his surroundings and adapt from people who come before him. I it leads straight to, to, the, to the anger there. We, we, we make him blind to the true reality of him I look for. The truth is bigger than what he thinks, you, you're saying? Yeah, man. Everything we most of we think no natural. It, it, it's a design for keep on making the worst decisions where, where, where the system benefit of. I can't say that enough. They make sure so we're surrounded in the ghetto by everything we distract with from our own progress. You think it's an accident make the average ghetto person eat education like poison virgin? The belief system we have make we see everything in a reverse and have everything back way. Yeah, because we confuse humility with weakness, anger with strength, and disagreement with disrespect. So all we have is a, uh, as a measure of self-worth is to live to prove how tough we is all the time without any kind of balance and protect our identity and that's how the problem start. Because we don't know, say we are protect a fraudulent and counterfeit self image. But we think our friend, but don't know, say our worst enemy. Because I eat a stop with progress. And we fight for it sometime at the expense of our, our life. Well, as most of we deal with music or any kind of success. We'll only just picture success as life itself. We defend the idiot in the mirror at the expense of our life or success. Quite often. And we socialize for beliefs so that idiot in the mirror is the smartest person. We know. I personally don't believe that Joshua did anything wrong. That make you and 95% of people, including a good many, with way more than three brain cells who think them intelligent. And sadly, a large portion of the brightest people don't and don't know. Because them don't have the spiritual intellect to see through the facade where them believe is reality. So me just have to shake my head. When me see them about the same ignorance to create the problems with them all ways I condemn. Right now, me only address this Joshi situation here, yeah, yeah, man, because it is the perfect practical example. We're showing real time when me always ask about the one track. Simple mindedness. We make, the, make even the brightest among us think everything is A, B, C and is always obvious. When there is no one size fits all solution to any problem, we, 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 we even, we even say Joshi and name out you now. My address in this issue is not only about Joshi, but a whole ghetto culture who program for often shoot themselves in a them foot and think of people are do it. It's funny how him actually have a story in a this interview yeah, where, where, where him talks and shoot himself in, in a him foot. 
because this is actually a popular phrase or term where them use to describe a situation where you sabotage yourself. If you look it up, your man really? is mean to damage your own cars without intent. Him actually a shoot himself in a foot on live TV if you're wise enough to see it. And this is because again the ghetto built on a culture of self-sabotage. And most of we cannot see it. While enough of our Joshi say it is it, very true. It is it, it not that simple. It's not. Bridging, you sit down on a program here for, for two years and I ask me that. You can either answer the question or move on. It's that simple. Not no simple, man. Every situation is unique, brethren. All right, all right. We'll, we'll start after the party, you know. We, we might have, we'll play a clip. We, we, we might talk about the elders and how them not help. Yeah, we'll play that first and then get into it. Here goes. The music that sold well in the 90s versus now strikes another nerve. First Nation ruling the charts in Jamaica, but Shabba Sean and Shaggy, Jamaica's international stars. Then and no. Can this current generation do it like the old guys did it? Oh yeah, that boy. I'm Skeng and 450 and Silk Boss and me. Joshi. Yeah, and Yaksta. DNA again. That's all. Brother. You covered a lot of Nation ground, Boss, brother. You covered a lot of Brother, ground. them and they are powerful youth. You know, for question that. The question they now for ask, they now for ask the question about that. If you, Anthony Miller, really love music like me, think you would have said them Monday, I go take music to a way different level. Them just need exposure, brother. So you see, Shabba ranks them, brother, and the whole of them name they way for call for give them Monday collaboration, figure, ex expose them to the world with a music farm. Now they're exposing, but music farm. Once them man they give them man they afraid, forget the, the exposure. Yes, Bounty Killer would have give me a collaboration. No, them man they are the street, brother. The rest of them where you are talk about where they live a foreign. You don't need to talk about them, brother. Talk about we That's know. That's all like a true matter, but only if you look on just the surface away, my say. And don't go deep. The truth about any situation where you face is not that simple. It's never that simple. No, you don't want to fucking help. Because them can't you say use the help. Help on something somebody give you, know, something you have to know for use. People can only give you opportunity. And you have to know for use it. Many garrison you too self conscious and full of pride. And always a think about what people think about them. And they make them stuck and freeze up because them can't take the risk in anything. And it don't work and people go laugh after them. The business culture we control the ghetto is completely opposite. For them culture, have its foundation in a, in, in a trial and error and problem solving. Not the problem dwelling will make we slave to them. Hey, Bridget, you know how much people me try help and have to run like me, your blood clot news. Where you say about Shabba not help nobody, go do your research. And look how Shabba try with a Bridget named Risto Benji. Yeah, man, research that. And Risco Benji, see him one get jealous of Shabba and lead the charge. Go broke Shabba house as see you and go thief him award them. He did that? Yeah, man. After all of that opportunity, him end up a rob people a road and get lock up feet and get bail. And it look like I set them set him so. But I know a little mother woman for out of St. Thomas. And the system, this a social sartery. Them set him so from him ban. Because when the man and him we are go quote for the same robbery. Him rob a woman and them catch him the same day and lock him up again. And him go on and go on till, till him go all over a thief bike and them kill him. Really? Yeah, man. There is almost no artist in the music who get the help of Risto Benji get. And him couldn't fucking use it because of the condition I mind. Not the unwillingness of Shabba for help. And no matter what people even to this day always find a way for blame Shabba. Why? Because... It is easy if you take the side of the victim player where you tell a story. When a majority of who are listening to the story is themselves a victim player. And that's why the liar is always believed because a pure liar that listen to them. You see how fast this thing here with Joshi trend. And people will claim for intelligent, them claim them intelligent. I run with it. Spiritual illiteracy is why again everything 
for we don't fall. I go always viral and stay trending. Because it is easier for me the victim. Because when you have victim, you get you get a reason for avoid your responsibilities. And that's why most people love that mindset. That's why with this interview, I know you see whole heap of people come out of ID and I say, oh, real talk. Yeah, man. Let me tell you something, man. No better go back in. Because I don't respect no now no bum buckler. I put a lazy man on the worst immorality you can think of in the same category. When you go imply say Shabba no help nobody, you need to think outside of the handout and come on the corner, come hang out where you consider as help. And realize say without Shabba or any other artist who come before you, you couldn't dare upon hear a chat fuck about him, whether directly or, or not. A people like Yellow Man and Shabba them kick down the door and make this music a value something. I make the same killer where your praise could have charged you much thousands for dub. Whether Shabba, Baby Sham, Beanie, Cartel, Bujo, Spraga, Shaggy and Sean Paul. The whole of them help you all if you don't know them in person. How the hell do I don't, I don't see where you, what you're getting at? Oh, you mean how them? Bridging. It is no different from the facts, eh? If one of them fuck me when make Joshy they are successful today, did miss. He mundi ya so. He ma forgive thanks for all those folks from the beginning of time will lead to this success in him life. Even if one or two of those folks was a rape from a slave master who never have no good intention. Will I see him where he ma forgive thanks for every man who stand up on them foot for keep this music alive and relevant till him forward. Even if them never directly do nothing for him or any of the long list of new youth them we him name out. Like a him and them create the dance hall where showcase them talent. Like a them started. Bridging, me, I'm tell you something, man. Hey, me, they try play that stupid game that you know, Bridging. But regardless of how me, that try convince myself, say, me, did know better. Me, they always know better. It was just that at that point, me, they afraid to do better because what? Doing that better around people who program for seat as weak was social suicide. Everything round we keep with stuck. Pan a anger, we blind with to the good in all people and things and situations. Hey, Joshy, let me tell you something. You have to learn to see the good in all things so you don't walk around with a bag of emotions with counterproductive. Because all when you get success, the bitterness where you still carry around will make you not even notice it. A whole heap of people miss this happen to Bridgen. Me never get no real help either. But you have to know sir, because you never get the help why you feel so good now because the struggle make you respect yourself. And quite often the person will stop help or never help you. A them do that for you, whether deliberately or otherwise. Sometimes not getting help is the actual help. If everyone did learn to see the good in all things, no matter how it fuck up and use it as such, they would have a better inside life and the burdens where they carry around wouldn't so heavy, but it's easier for blame people till you're in your 60s. But that have terrible consequences, brethren. There is no worse creation than a man or woman with wisdom discovered late in life and can't go back. This Joshy thing here is another story. We show how hard it is for the average person to follow common sense and figure out that so the problem is them and that nobody can stop you except you. How long Bingy Ride did have to tell you no that? Joshy actually said to, but him don't believe it and I'm going to tell you no why. Why would you say that? Well on, Bridget, just well on, man. This story has been many of the elements when I show the item in this program from day one. And one of the elements is the walking contradiction where many people is and don't know. Because them conscious and them subconscious life is not in sync. Or in a harmony with each other. Or all the same set of values. For example, Joshi in a one part of the interview say, When a your time are your time. And no man can stop what is yours. And yet right after that him go further down go contradict himself. By complaining say artist not help nobody. Oh yes I saw that. I was wondering why he would do that. Because the average person don't realize that everything with them believe consciously is just them intentions that when them truly believe in them subconscious means that the part of them consciousness where them not aware of we put everything with them truly believe into not only them action but even words where them don't even notice say them I say most of the time because what you know even though them consciously believe say when are your time are your time and, and, and every other positive thing we hear and recite. If him or anyone not truly accept, say the old ignorance we have in the victim plane is or was wrong, then when them even get new information or prove it wrong, them just them just are gonna agree with it and think them believe it. But if him not practice it and replace them previous ignorance with this new information, the old ignorance will control them subconscious life 
I go manipulate the new information and cause them to become a pretender who is a slave to them subconscious ignorance and the rules at the same point every level. At the same thing as why most relationships now work. Because people now change. They are mimic change instead of practice it. I can't say it enough. Because again, them believe. So them have to keep up with everyone. So them believe. So them don't have no time for change. Because I know. Them have, them have a competition for win. If you don't think objectively, let me tell you something, man. You won't even realize when a person contradict themselves. Me I tell you that. And why is that? Because a man can talk six things that is absolutely true, but don't realize say, these six things even do are true. Them not always true under the same circumstances. For example, a man can say, boy, oh, him write 40 yard song, you know, for the artist, for this or that artist, and when the artist help him get the spotlight as promised based upon them agreement, the artist turn him back on him. Then argument like the artist never helped me is objectively true in that case for that person there. A next man can accuse that same artist now down the line of the same unwillingness for help. And in that case now, let's just say the reason why I make the accusation is just because he want the artist drop everything and come pay him rent and raise him pity them. Because I saw him see help and don't notice how much money or opportunity the artist give him daily. The problem is interpretation. If I saw the man look on it, then the belief say the artist, despite his reputation, nah help. Becomes a lie under those circumstances. Truth really not as simple as people think. And you will never be humble until you realize that. All right, we'll play another part of the interview you now. I tell all of my friends, them say, yo, me no friend killer. But if my friend, them really, I try if he kill me, what do you feel like me to do? Eh? Me tell my friend, them I'm grow with from Marble and box chuck and pampas and nappy say if me find out say one of them i try to kill me me i go murder them where you think me should have done where you think me for do i don't think man say if him find out so when i'm bridging a pre for murder him i murder them and usually i you know you know these ghetto circumstances we have this kind of mindset a talk like that usually means say if a man hear say a man a pray for kill him, you know, years say. Not confirm or verify if murder is needed with a blue ticky. Him just a go kill them. That me now say if me want to kill one of him friend, all me have to do is tell him. Say the friend a pray for kill him. And him a go end up to the whole of the dirty work for me. I end up a prison. And I think you now say the worst mistake where you, whose profession is an artist, yeah, make in another interview there. You never see that day there, you know. But the people who give out license for gun, did I listen? And them now go get somebody where them consider irresponsible a license for a gun. And the police them where you call corrupt and load up the wickedest way. Now go and be seen with you. Cause people are gonna know see at them at the corrupt police. So you now go have them protection. So whole heap of your foot them you shoot, man. And where you get so much foot? It look like you're a spider. You now think bridging. Because when you alienate or cut off all your legal means of protection. You have to only live with the friend them where you definitely have to go kill. Because nobody now protect you. And them know. And the way you have to plan to protect yourself, you have to put in the system where you think you're smarter than. And the next thing again now, the man say if him friends not happy, boy, him not happy. I am mean, totally understand that. But it not, this again is not as simple like how him think. And then why is that? You can't make people happy, Bridget. That is up to them. I understand what, what Joshi try to say. So. But be careful, Joshi, where you wish for. I don't think you know what you say when, 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 when you say, boy, if 100 are there, so I may have 100,000 every man, I forget a thousand. And if, if, if everybody get a grand and tomorrow now, when I do some dub, they might go understand and not and go stretch out. Not no go so bridging. You mean, say, tomorrow, them now go member say them get yesterday. And you are going to be the biggest pussy if you can't do that for them today. A true friend wants you better improve yourself. Even if you and them are hungry for make it happen. And the same thing with a real spouse. As you to not start thinking deep, Bridgerton. Because one day you go embarrassed by them naive talk you you make. And I better me ask you better why me I say this. I totally understand what the youth are trying to say. We're taking care of people around here if you have it is concerned. But even even taking care this taking care of people is it's not simple like how most of we see it. Really? And then why why is that? Bridgerton, for truly help somebody is not for half of them and out. But to encourage them to hold them own and can depend on them own self. 
not to treat them like your baby mother. Or maybe, or maybe me shouldn't even say that. Because some man treat them friend better than them baby mother and them youth. But yeah, help your friend by helping them to help themselves. Because when them search themselves and can't find somebody with them respect, then the next move naturally I got always be to compare themselves to the person who I get all of the respect, which is most likely you. If you in a the position where, where, where you are mind them. Too often this have serious consequences, Bridget. Because you actually are gonna create the friends we are gonna pray for kill you. If them feel useless, because if them not have confidence in them own ability to provide for themselves. They are going to want to kill you for yours, where you broke them in a thing that is owed to them, or that, or, or that them is entitled to. After a while, they are going to know the difference between your kindness and your obligation, and, and that this how your problem start. Listen to me, Joshi. Nobody check Facebook, check Lexus, and make him tell you about friends. And how quick them number change when you're not at. And I want to bet if him even tell you the first thing you're going to say is that him bad mind. Like how you might have said me bad mind, you know. But if me or anyone bad mind, them not go tell you. So stop trying to figure out the intention of the messenger and focus on the quality of the message. We're bigger than them. You can feel how you want to feel, you know. You have that right. But if you don't believe, says that trap you are walking you know, with this attitude towards fame, ask Predator. We fame 100 man we used to run behind him like them at train for the Olympics. Ask him with them there. Right now, him, him can commit any crime at Portmore because not even the hundred man police station at Portmore don't want to see him. No hundred man to be found nowhere near Predator. We all had the selector them where Predator used to fling money upon for, for pull up him song. Where them there? Them still have play him song them? Him no stop DJ, you know? Ask Gullibap where the people them will take him out of the gully and laugh to every joke there. Ask him where them there right now. Ask him where every girl you want to walk off of him. And never did I watch no teeth or no lele water. That's true. Yeah, man, ask him. Where them there? No, for who I talk now, and I say, the realest talk and a bus blank. Back him. Let me tell you something, Bridget. No, for who I run into your thing right now, no, no real from cotton real. When you know at you, I go know who is who. They all disappear, you saying? Yeah, man, all the at y'all them and the whole heap of friend them from bike. Where you used to sleep in your fall cub. Just for say them press one of your shot. I go disappear and gone on to the next. But while you have the opportunity, use it wisely, my little virgin. Because you say tomorrow, if them deny or take away your visa, them same pussy hole, you're going to say you're the biggest idiot. Apart from 40-year-old children, let me tell you something. There is nothing uglier than an old supermodel or an old that broke superstar or deportee. We are talking about what them used to have and always get them get a fight while them end up so. I hope that will never have to be the pint where even Josh have to learn the hard way. And possibly even want one a youth about, about fee mistake. And at that point, him could have want a wallet. Him most likely wallet and no one want to say nothing because why him three of them man are going to say him bad mind. And the lack of true communication will separate people from them upliftment and promote them downfall will fucking continue. My bro, there seems to be a growing lack of respect from the present generation of artists for their elders uh, who set right. the foundation that they're standing on. Um, is it always a case where the elders, like you say, um, like you often say, drop the button and, and, and leave, leave up the youths to their own devices, as, as you would say, my brother? Not all the time. While me agree the elders need to guide youth in a music, there is also the other side, where youth have to be receptive or accepting of guidance. The problem with music, you know, fly past guidance. Because in a case, like the music itself, you know, yeah, we are, we are looked upon as structural malfunction, where the principles that make the music great in the beginning is concerned, yeah, man, because these principles are no longer in place. Oh, can you imply that um, the old days were better than, but better when there are? Oh, wait, hold it, on, right. my brother. Well, hold on, hold on. When, 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 when there are uh, no more advances in technology, that um, often helps people to do more and to get it done faster. I, I don't, I don't see what you say. I don't see it. I, I don't see. It. What used to work in the old days was that there was a system where the youths of the day never have no choice but to work with. You understand? Them did have to follow the order. Them did have humble and butter out of studio gate and burn up in a sun and go, if you go buy KFC for big artists and producer. If you get a chance for record. Because other people own and control the means by which them successful. Even though that sound like and was often a terrible thing. It is these fuck up circumstances where it make the earlier artists them great. But Babylon give the new generation, you know, a blessing that is also a curse. 
when you have the internet, when them can easily set up a laptop and vice themselves and release them song on YouTube. So them feel say them don't need no one, which is true. But them also end up feel say them don't need no guideline or need for learn any kind of core principle when make this thing a work. I can only see the internet as a blessing for music. I, I can't see. I don't see the curse. I, I can't. I don't. I, I don't. I, I, I can't see. Reggie, I agree with you. Yes, it is a blessing in the sense where it make you can do what you want to do and you have that freedom there. But a curse in the sense where it remove the challenges where it help you appreciate the success where you get out of where you do. What do you mean? A discipline make every type of child, even adult children, into adults. Let me tell you that. Nobody will get anything too easy, cannot respect it. For example, that is easiness of pussy, kill the dating game, you know, Bridget, I tell you that. One time when, when a woman did have a certain character about themselves, and never too easy, it didn't make the man respect them more. Now with this easiness, you know, where the woman them subscribe to, and I call it freedom, they might kill the relationship game. Because of the challenges where a woman used to put man through, used to build the man's self-esteem. Because it brings a sense of adversity and make the man respect himself. So because it gets so easier now, man, and many man, the whole of man lose their motivation. For put in work, for make it work. Challenges needed for self-respect in all scenarios, including music. From the beginning of this program, I even way before me, I tell the item that. And don't get me wrong, you know. Every era of them share of worthless people, don't get me wrong. But the old days did produce more of the people who pushed down barriers because them did have to fight for it. Yeah, man, me I tell you, say, this demonic system, yeah, brethren, create more of the things that make people rebel against natural order. Them get the internet to promote this false idea of freedom through indiscipline and confusion, which now have no else to lead but to spiritual destruction. Because when you don't respect and bow to the process of anything where you want, whether music or marriage or otherwise, and that make it no work for you because what? You have to undervalue it. A pile, this new generation of artists, a pile rasta. Make all the while you see them sit down and talk, be a fuck about elders. You think so? Oh, you mean everything so? I know so, brethren. I bored them bored. And now have nothing to do because the elders them do all right already. Hey, watch a man. And the elders them open the door when no one go on like say, I want go hard where go by. When you never did it when, 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 when these elders, no for these elders, they have to often stand up to the criticisms of them own family. Who are call them idiot. If you go lift up sound box, I put box pan chuck and a, and a bleach in a night jew go, 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 go dance, go DJ. Free. We don't have a clue how much them people are sacrificed to turn the world attention to an art farm where people used to call fuckery and nice. You know how much time away from them children and them family. It costs these elders. Just so you can come drink champagne in a mig like this and I tell you no friend them say for wheelie. It's rough to see the man them do all of that for no. Only if you get disrespect, watch a man. My advice to all of the item man, if you now go think deep, don't fucking say nothing. Most of the new artists learn the tricks of the trade. The veteran them actually learn the trade. Most of them cannot sing out a song or perform for save on a fucking life. And earn the respect when they demand. When you see what I mean when I say everything at the same for every level. And that how you do anything is how you do everything. You see so most of the modern women them move. And at the same false idea of freedom through chaos. I cause it. Right now, put anyone on a new boy on a stage with, with Papa and our stitcher, you know, if you keep up with them. On the last, on the born in our time, on you know, can use the computer like makeup for cover up on the flaws and make it appear, say, you know, it's something that you know not. See the real problem there. For most of the modern generation, the, 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 the unwillingness to do the work in any way, shape, or form. It's rough to see the eye them and get the benefits of everything where the elders work for and I slap them in them face, Virgin. I fuck with that. But now I say every new artist is ungrateful, you know, because even some of you joshing him out, a good artist with good attitude. But me I say just respect the core values where the music built upon. I mean, now I say go back into the past, you know, Virgin. Me I say remain true to the core values. Do it like Dexter Dabs. Them new, yeah, man. Dexter Dabs, Romeo and Virgo, and them youth there. Eh? With those core values that showing of them talent. I went, well, they are well, 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 90s artists. And Joshi, let me tell you something. Don't follow the fool, them your boots, your ego, you. Let me tell you that. Excess ego is a fucking liar. Don't make the numbers fool you when it comes to everyone who has them love you and real talk. And you're the greatest thing because most people are fucking fool. That mean.
extreme popularity in our world full of mostly fool is not a compliment. Because if people are idiot, who them naturally are attracted to? Another fucking idiot. Fucking fucking idiot. idiot. Fucking idiot. Oh. In the meantime, 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 in, the meantime, in, the meantime, in between time. Time in the meantime, in the meantime, in between time. Hey. Boom, 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 time.